I think the civil society is the core id the core institution or the core entity in the society that can uh, make the government accountable because we don't have a political interest we are there we are just fighting for democracy equality these values in the society so we will see what the government is doing and we will evaluate it according to the international standards about the democracy, the freedom, the dignity, the equality, justice. So, and we will just giving our feedback and we will, have, we will like if the government can interact and ask more about what we can do or, just, or maybe adapt some of the recommendations and, or some of the plans that we usually submit to them. But in most of the Arab countries, and I would say that in Egypt also, they are not adapting any of these plans and they usually ignore these reports. Maybe this is kind of, they are not uh, trusting us that much. They will not like that. Anyone will go and say, you're not going well. This this uh, action is not well, this is not the right action in the right time. You, usually the country is doing that, or usually the countries are having this way. They will not accept it. But this is kind of the struggle, even in the most democratic country. The government usually will not like all the reporters or the feedback that it takes from the civil society. But it will depend about how they are reflected to the are they going just to ignore or they are going to ignore and attack these people? And this is actually maybe what's happening now in Egypt. Concern is the rates for the NGOs offices. Because they thought that if we just let them continue their workers, this is maybe making some troubles for us. So we are going to attack them and close their offices. And after this, when, when this happened actually, I was sitting with some of the human rights activists and we said, what will happen if they close the offices? And they told them, that's it. We are going to go and work from the street. We have the streets and usually we don't use our offices to work. People are in the streets and we are mainly interacting with them. And we don't need offices anyway.